So we're here in Copenhagen preparing for the ECOFIN, the Ministers of Finance meeting. Uh, everybody is preparing, the event is just a few hours away and we're all really busy. I will take you through uh, and uh, show you some of the initiatives we have uh, put in place uh, to make this event a sustainable event. Um, let me give you a few examples of that. Here we have our lanyard collection boxes. We collect uh, uh, lanyards from our guests. These are made from uh, uh, recycled materials, but we reuse them again. So this is our plenary hall. This is where the meeting uh, will take place in a few hours from now. All the ministers of finance will negotiate in here. Um, this room is decorated uh, with uh, some lovely flowers. All these flowers are on uh, clots. We don't use cut flowers. In that way we uh, reduce waste. We reduce costs because we can use these flowers from uh, meeting to meeting. All the ministers in here will drink tap water if they are thirsty. Uh, we have been dubbed the Tap Water Presidency. It's, uh, it's a nickname we are very proud of because it signals that we care about the resources and we care about uh, our waste and we care about our CO2 emissions. We try to use uh, regular glasses because they can be reused over and over again. But if, uh, if people require and or need uh, plastic glasses, we have these. These are made from cornstarch and they are biodegradable. So uh, they will be turned into new glasses. As you can see, our organic decorations uh, are found throughout the, the venue and uh, all electricity uh, during the presidency stems from Danish uh, wind turbines. We have a waste management system uh, in place all over the venue. The waste is collected and then uh, handled by the conference venue that sorts it in uh, 16 different categories. Yeah, now here we're going over to the area where we take all our waste and then we sort it in the 16 categories. In a normal year we have about 800 uh, tons of waste. Here you can see uh, gypsonite and we have here plastic and here we have wood and uh, on the other side we have uh, iron, paper and uh, carpets. This is uh, the area, area for the family photo. Um, this area is covered in a carpet made from uh, corn. This uh, reduces the CO2 emissions drastically um, and it looks really good. In the kitchen, we do a lot of uh, sustainable initiatives. All our menus are based on uh, seasonal ingredients. We have a lot of focus on local suppliers. Around 50% of our groceries comes from Scandinavia. All our dairy products are Danish and organic. We are also beekeepers. On the top of Hall A, we have uh, honeybees. They live in six uh, beehives. And the honey we harvest uh, from those hives are used at the uh, Bella Sky Hotel. And this is the system for food waste. The waste goes down here get grounded, dehydrated and transported directly to a biogas plant. Here it gets converted and used for energy to Danish households. So when planning a sustainable event, it's obviously important what goes on outside the conference venue also. We only use eco-certified hotel rooms and of course it's important to choose a location close to public transportation. I hope we've shown that uh, we're capable of arranging uh, very large-scale uh, events in a sustainable way in Denmark and uh, hopefully uh, you will come and join us.